Just imagine, the world of electric cars is about to take a leap so far, it almost seems like science fiction. In 2026, Tesla decided to come clean and reveal something that promises to turn the entire automotive industry upside down. The new aluminum ion battery. Elon Musk, known for his bold promises, called this innovation the Three Promise Formula. And that's no exaggeration. We're talking about a fire-safe battery with a near-eternal lifespan and one that won't suffer from supply shortages. This announcement alone has already rattled the nerves of all competitors, and there's no denying the enormous anticipation. After all, who hasn't felt butterflies in their stomach upon hearing news of batteries catching fire? The first detail that leaves anyone speechless is the idea of eliminating the fear of fires. Until now, despite technology's advancements, there's always been a feeling that driving an electric car was like carrying a silent bomb underfoot. Now, with aluminum at the center of the equation, that threat has almost completely disappeared. Musk has stated clearly that this battery doesn't carry the same explosion risk as lithium-ion batteries, and that changes everything. People will finally feel free to fully trust the car they drive. It's like lifting an invisible weight that's always been there. But what's truly intriguing is the promise of longevity. Until now, any EV owner knew that sooner or later they'd have to replace the battery. A costly, exhausting process that devalues the car. But now, with this technology, Musk claims 15,000 cycles without significant degradation. This is equivalent to hundreds of thousands of miles driven without a noticeable drop in performance. It's as if the car had a heart that never ages. For those who thought they'd need to replace the battery after a few years, this is a revolution that changes the way we plan a vehicle's lifespan. And of course, we can't ignore the third promise, goodbye supply bottlenecks. Until now, lithium was seen as the white gold of the electric age, but also as a problem of global dependency. Aluminum, by contrast, is one of the most abundant materials on the planet. Tesla has found a way to use this abundance to its advantage, ensuring that large-scale production isn't hindered by political disputes or geological limitations. This means that, for the first time, a mass-market electric car can be produced without fear of battery shortages. This vision is bold, but incredibly logical. The most curious thing is to realize how this change affects not only the technical aspects, but also people's imagination. Starting in 2026, consumers will look at a Tesla and see not only technology, but also stability and reliability. After all, who wouldn't want to drive knowing the car's battery is virtually indestructible? The peace of mind this innovation promises may be even more valuable than the performance itself. It's a new way of thinking about mobility, without the hidden concerns that always accompanied the first electric models. What's more, competitors are already feeling the pressure. Automakers that invested billions in lithium research are now having to play catch-up. It's as if Tesla pulled the rug out from under them and changed the rules of the game at the last minute. Companies that boasted of being prepared for the future are now forced to revise strategies in record time. It's that typical movement that separates those who lead from those who follow. And frankly, Musk seems to relish this role of challenging and destabilizing the market. What's most striking about this new battery is the end of the fear of fires. For many years, lithium was seen as a double-edged sword, powerful for storing energy, but unpredictable in situations of extreme heat or shock. Now, with the move to aluminum, this shadow of uncertainty is beginning to disappear. The secret lies in the chemistry and design. The electrolyte, which in lithium is flammable, has been replaced with a stable gel, incapable of catching fire. It's as if someone removed the fuse from a ticking time bomb, leaving only clean energy for safe use. Another surprising aspect is the thermal resistance. While lithium starts to become dangerous at 120 degrees, Aluminum works without problems up to 250 degrees. This difference practically doubles the safety margin, 
and it's something any driver can easily understand. Imagine cruising down a highway in the Arizona desert or parking your car under the scorching Florida sun without even thinking about the possibility of the system failing. It's the peace of mind every EV owner has always dreamed of, but never achieved. The innovation doesn't stop there. Tesla developed a honeycomb-shaped cathode structure filled with microhexagons that increase the contact area by up to five times. This design dissipates heat 40 times faster than a conventional lithium cell. In other words, the battery itself helps cool itself without the need for complicated external devices. It's a simple yet brilliant step. The idea that the cell can self-protect is something that, until recently, seemed impossible. And if that already sounds impressive, there's an extra layer of protection. Engineers applied a nano-ceramic coating, just zero, five micrometers thick, so thin it's equivalent to one one-hundredth the thickness of a human hair. This detail ensures that aluminum ions circulate evenly, avoiding microscopic congestion that previously caused hot spots and, eventually, explosions. It's almost like creating a perfect highway for energy to flow without blockages or potholes. One of the biggest culprits in lithium batteries has always been dendrites, small metallic structures that grow over time inside the cell and end up penetrating barriers, causing short circuits. In the case of aluminum, this formation simply doesn't occur. This means that the silent risk, which even experts feared, no longer exists. There's no need to resort to cumbersome containment systems because the problem has been eliminated at its root. It's an elegant and definitive solution. This advancement has direct repercussions on drivers' real lives. With every news story of exploding scooters, cell phones, or cars, public confidence in electric vehicles took a hit. Now, with a system that eliminates 99.3% of the risk of fire, even in cases of overheating or minor collisions, perceptions are radically changing. Driving is no longer seen as an act of faith in technology, but as a safe and reliable experience. One of the most intriguing aspects of this revolution is realizing that, for the first time, the battery itself has become a complete protection system. Previously, with lithium, it was necessary to add complex cooling mechanisms with pumps, liquids, radiators, and even shielding to prevent accidents. This increased weight, cost, and made the vehicle more expensive for the consumer. Now, aluminum solves this equation naturally. The cell's three-dimensional structure, based on an intelligent geometric arrangement, disperses heat 40 times faster than lithium, as if it were a living organism breathing and balancing its own temperature. This feature completely changes the way electric cars are designed. Imagine a vehicle that doesn't need to carry kilos of tubes and tanks to keep the battery stable. This space can be used to extend range, reduce weight, or even increase interior comfort. It's as if engineers have finally freed design from the shackles that limited creativity. In terms of efficiency, every gram saved in cooling represents additional kilometers on the road. Another consequence is endurance in extreme conditions. Think of the long highways of Texas, where the asphalt temperature easily exceeds 70 centigrade, or the Nevada desert with its sweltering heat. In these situations, a lithium battery suffers, wears out, and can even fail. The aluminum battery, on the other hand, remains steadfast, working calmly even when the world around it seems to be melting. It's as if it were tailor-made to withstand the most hostile climates on the planet. In addition to thermal safety, there's also a gain in reliability during collisions. When there are no flammable liquids circulating inside the cells, the risk of explosion in the event of an impact drops dramatically. The car becomes less vulnerable, and this feeling of solidity is transmitted to the driver. It's not just technology, it's confidence built into everyday life. A driver can cross the country knowing that neither heat nor light impacts will turn the battery into a hidden threat. This elimination of cumbersome systems also means lower production and maintenance costs. Automakers that once relied on complex cooling technologies 
now see Tesla advancing a simpler, more effective solution. It's almost ironic. While many have invested fortunes in protective layers, Musk and his team solved the problem at the core. The result is a battery that is not only safer, but also cheaper to manufacture on a large scale. The impact goes beyond the car itself. Without the need for auxiliary cooling systems, even recycling and future disposal become simpler. There are no hazardous fluids to handle, no additional materials to separate. This makes the entire production chain cleaner and more sustainable. It's a consequence that, while not often discussed, carries enormous weight when considering a green future. When it comes to safety, nothing matters more than crash tests. And that's exactly where Tesla decided to put its new aluminum ion battery to the test. In its internal labs, engineers simulated severe accidents, the kind that would make any driver freeze just imagining them. The results were surprising. The risk of fire dropped to just 0.05%. For comparison, lithium-ion batteries have, on average, a 2.5% chance of catching fire in similar situations. We're talking about a 50-fold reduction in risk, a leap that seems almost unrealistic in terms of automotive engineering. This statistical difference isn't just a pretty number to show in reports. In practice, it means that, in a thousand serious collisions, only one or two would result in a fire with aluminum, compared to dozens with lithium. This completely changes people's relationship with their vehicles. Driving no longer carries that invisible fear that, in an accident, in addition to the impact, there would also be the threat of an explosion. It's a psychological relief that can outweigh technical advances. In the most extreme tests, where the impact causes profound deformations in the structure, lithium batteries became veritable time bombs. Friction, heat generation, and the rupture of separators created the perfect scenario for sparks and combustion. In aluminum, however, even under absurd pressure, the cells maintain their integrity. The most that happens is slight heating, but no chance of flames. It's as if Tesla had taught the energy to behave even in chaotic situations. Another important detail is that, without flammable liquids inside the cells, there's no chain reaction. In older models, just one cell failing would quickly spread the fire to the others. With aluminum, this possibility disappears. Each cell operates independently and, even if broken, doesn't fuel a fire. This characteristic gives drivers a sense of invisible armor, as if the car were capable of containing any problem on its own. This added safety has a direct impact on consumer confidence. For families, for example, knowing that an electric car can better protect their children in the event of an accident is a much stronger argument than talking about range or acceleration. It touches on something intimate, the idea of being protected even when the worst happens. This emotional connection can be the deciding factor for those still hesitant to switch to an EV. Interestingly, this advancement also puts pressure on insurers and regulators. With a battery 50 times safer, it makes no sense to maintain the same risk tables applied to lithium-ion cars. This could lead to significant reductions in insurance premiums for vehicles equipped with the new technology. This is a practical consequence that goes beyond the technology itself and directly impacts consumers' pockets. The new aluminum battery's promise of longevity may seem like fiction, but it's real. Imagine a car that can travel up to 3 million miles, roughly 4, 8 million kilometers, without needing to be replaced. For comparison, current lithium-ion models can reach 300,000 or, in more robust cases, 500,000 miles before losing efficiency. It's as if Tesla had multiplied the lifespan of an electric car tenfold, transforming the battery into an asset that lasts much longer than the vehicle itself. This jump occurs because aluminum doesn't suffer from the same problems as lithium. In conventional batteries, carbon solvents evaporate and leave solid deposits on the electrodes, which hinder the movement of ions and gradually reduce capacity. This is what we call degradation. Aluminum, on the other hand, 
uses a polymer gel electrolyte with a boiling point of 300 Kreetstrix, which doesn't evaporate and doesn't form these unwanted crusts. The result is a seemingly endless life cycle. The idea of a battery lasting 200 years sounds far-fetched, but it makes sense when you look at the numbers. The average American drives about 12,000 miles per year. At that rate, it would take two centuries to reach the limit of an aluminum battery. This means that for the first time, battery replacement is no longer a concern during the lifespan of an electric car. Maintenance, currently seen as the Achilles heel of EVs, simply disappears from the equation. This durability also impacts the used car market. Consider selling an electric car after 10 years of use. Typically, the depreciation is significant because the buyer fears having to spend between $13,000 and $22,000 on a new battery. With aluminum, the vehicle maintains almost all of its original range, losing only about 10% even after 20,000 charge cycles. This ensures a much fairer resale value, transforming the car into a long-term investment. And here comes a personal point of view. This is perhaps Tesla's greatest asset so far. More than talking about fire safety or ultra-fast charging, what really resonates with consumers is knowing that their car won't lose value quickly. It's like buying a house knowing it won't deteriorate over time. This financial security can be as revolutionary as the technological innovation itself. Another curious detail is the battery's resistance to fast charging. While lithium batteries suffer when subjected to high temperatures during intense recharges, aluminum batteries seem to strengthen under these conditions. The ions move even more easily, allowing extremely high currents without the risk of premature wear. This ensures that the promise of millions of miles isn't incompatible with the desire to recharge your car in minutes. If talking about millions of miles of battery life already seemed impressive, what comes next leaves anyone speechless. The ability to recharge in near instantaneous time. The aluminum battery can reach 80% charge in just three minutes and 100% in less than five. That's less time than many people spend making a cup of coffee. This speed is possible because, unlike lithium, aluminum doesn't lose efficiency at high temperatures. In fact, it uses heat to facilitate the movement of ions, transforming what was once a risk into an advantage. This feature completely changes the driving experience. Today, even with superchargers, drivers need to plan their trips considering long stops. With the new system, the weight disappears. On a thousand kilometer trip, a short break would suffice, the kind any family would take to stretch their legs or buy a snack. Recharging is no longer an inconvenience and becomes as natural as filling up a gasoline car, perhaps even faster. Another interesting point is the reduction in lines at charging stations. If a car takes 40 minutes to fill up, a buildup of vehicles is inevitable. Now, with a five-minute wait, the flow becomes dynamic, almost like at a traditional station. This agility could be the missing detail to convince even the most skeptical that electric cars are ready to replace combustion-powered cars once and for all. Tesla also leverages this advantage to explore new infrastructure solutions. Imagine smaller stations, eliminating the need for dozens of chargers in parallel, as occupancy time is minimal. This reduces deployment costs and allows charging points to emerge in unlikely locations, grocery stores, neighborhood store parking lots, or even small highway rest areas. The democratization of charging becomes a reality. This impressive speed doesn't compromise the battery's lifespan. On the contrary, it's designed specifically to withstand extremely high currents, reaching rates of 100 degrees to e to decrescent without overheating dangerously. While lithium degrades after a few fast charge cycles, 